Welcome to our quick look at three big military and industrial ships in Star Citizen. The Aegis Hammerhead is a multi-use, multi-crew military vehicle. The interior is very consistently designed. This is clearly a warship. The endless corridors with padding on the walls in case things get a bit lively outside is straight out of classic sci-fi like Starship Troopers. There are turrets everywhere, basic but well designed crew accommodation, although not quite as basic as some of the industrial ships we're about to see. And escape pods for when the time comes to abandon ship. Signage is clear throughout which is great for working out where to go when everything is on fire. The bridge has a panoramic view out front with rugged window pillars for strength and even features good old fashioned toggle switches. Of course the captain gets his own quarters although they're not really much different to the crews in terms of comfort. The Hammerhead's massive engine bay contains the two church hall sized boosters. As we say farewell to the Hammerhead, we meet the Caterpillar. This is the cargo hauler. When we step inside, you'll see just how much cargo this thing can carry, it's unreal. The interior of the Caterpillar is not built for comfort. Super basic living quarters, barely bearable bunks, and a toilet designed for the community minded. Let's take a wander through the endless cargo bays of the Caterpillar. This can carry 576 standard cargo units of stuff, probably enough to make you a multi-millionaire in one trip. As you'd expect on an industrial ship, there's a lot of exposed component access for maintainability and making sure that important cargo keeps moving. The flight deck is utilitarian and of course there's also turrets for defence. The Cutlass Black is the most popular entry level cargo slash transport ship in Star Citizen. It has enough space in the cargo bay for a rover and 46 standard cargo units of stuff. There are also living quarters for longer trips for a crew of two. Once again a huge thank you to the community for sharing these ships with new players like myself and I'll see you in game. Thank you.